The Type 10 main battle tank, MBT, represents Japan's latest advancement in military technology. During its prototype phase, it was referred to as TKX. This innovative lightweight MBT boasts a smaller size and significantly reduced weight in comparison to contemporary battle tanks. Notably lighter than Japan's current Type 90 main battle tank, the Type 10 was designed to adhere to Japanese road regulations. This attribute facilitates its transport on standard commercial trailers and enhances its suitability for sea transportation. The development of the TKX initiative commenced in the early 2000s, with certain subsystems dating back to the late 1990s. A primary focus was placed on bolstering command, control, communications, computers, and intelligence C4I, capabilities, as well as elevating protection, firepower, and mobility. The vehicle was publicly unveiled in 2008 and Mitsubishi Heavy Industries serves as the main contractor for the Type 10. It currently stands as one of the world's most advanced main battle tanks. In 2010, the Japanese Ministry of Defense ordered 13 units, which were integrated into service with the Japanese ground self-defense forces by 2012. This new MBT aims to replace the aging Type 74 and supplement the existing Type 90 MBTs. This Japanese tank can be classified more as a medium tank rather than a conventional main battle tank, as it was designed with asymmetric warfare in mind. It lacks the substantial armor typically found on contemporary main battle tanks and primarily serves to provide firepower support to infantry rather than engage enemy tanks. The Type 10 places significant emphasis on protection against various anti-tank rockets, such as RPG-type projectiles. The vehicle incorporates a sloped modular ceramic composite armor similar to that of the Leopard 2A5, and its side profile resembles the Leclerc tank. Damaged armor modules can be readily replaced in field conditions, and add-on armor can be removed to reduce combat weight for ease of transportation, down to 40 tons. The tank is equipped with NBC protection and automatic fire suppression systems. Its smoke grenade launchers are linked to laser warning receivers that trigger upon laser beam illumination. This passive protection system reduces the likelihood of being hit by semi-automatically guided anti-tank missiles. Crewed by three individuals, commander, gunner, and driver, the Type 10 features an automatic ammunition loading system, eliminating the need for a dedicated loader. Armed with a 120mm smoothbore gun developed by Japan Steelworks, the Type 10 tank is equipped with an advanced autoloader located in the turret bustle. This autoloader surpasses its predecessor on the Type 90 MBT and is compatible with newly developed armor-piercing ammunition, as well as standard 120mm NATO tank ammunition. Supplementary armament consists of a coaxially mounted 7.62mm machine gun and a roof-mounted remotely controlled 12.7mm heavy machine gun. The advanced fire control system enables the vehicle to engage both stationary and moving targets. Additional attributes of the Type 10 encompass a digital battlefield management system and navigation system, which enhance rapid coordination and situational awareness. The power pack and driveline of the Type 10 tank incorporate state-of-the-art technology. Propelled by a newly developed Mitsubishi HI-8BA34WTK diesel engine, generating 1,200 horsepower from a 22.6-liter V8 unit, the tank achieves an impressive power-to-weight ratio of 27 horsepower per ton. Coupled with a continuously variable transmission CVT, this transmission enables the tank to move in reverse at a top speed of 70 km per hour. The Type 10 MBT is also outfitted with a cutting-edge semi-active hydropneumatic suspension, allowing the tank to adjust its stance, sitting, standing, kneeling, or leaning, in any direction. This feature provides numerous advantages, particularly in mountainous terrain. Some tanks are equipped with a front-mounted dozer blade. Interestingly, in 2014, Turkey expressed interest in acquiring a production license for the engine of the Type 10 tank, intending to integrate it into the domestic Altai main battle tank. However, Japan declined to transfer the technology. 
Variants include the Type 11 Armored Recovery Vehicle, designed to support the Type 10 tanks. Based on the Type 10 tank chassis, it features an armored superstructure in place of a turret and is equipped with recovery equipment. Production of the Type 11 commenced in 2011.